Hey guys, it's Brie. So today I'm going to do a review on the DDB Curves range. If you have been following me, you'll know I did a review not too long ago, about two months ago, on her usual style or her ordinary DDB Secrets. But this is her DDB, it still says Secrets on it, but it's her Curves range. So she does beautiful embroidery on her pads, and that's one of the main ways you can tell her pads apart from others. There are a few other companies that do embroidery, but she does the absorbency of her pads by the centre stitching. Um, one of the things that she does that is very different from other people as well is that she can actually change the embroidery stitch so if you want a specific sit stitch on a website I believe you can choose from a number of them like um, there's a Doctor Who TARDIS stitch and I know some of you might like that uh, I think she can basically put anything on it to be honest if you want you just have to pay a bit of an extra fee for it uh, but this particular one is just with her um, absorbency stitch so this is the butterfly I believe the flower is for panty liner the Butterfly is for moderate, the moon is for night, and I can't remember what the heavy is, but I'll put it here. So this is OBV Top. The one she sent me before was cotton jersey. I actually hadn't had a cotton jersey pad before then, and I discovered I really didn't like the fabric. So she was very good, and she offered to send me another one in her new style and with a different fabric, and it's OBV, which I knew I loved. And I love purple, so that's really good too. It's a very narrow pad, she gives you two snap options. The first time I wore it, I wore it on the first snap option, and the second time I wore it, I wore it on the second snap option, which is really, really quite narrow. Um, the first time I had a big, big issue with leaking, um, it bunched up here, and I don't know if you can see this, but it did this, so what I did was bled onto the micro fleece, and micro fleece is not that resistant at all, and it just went straight through and I bled all over my underwear. Um, but then the second time I used it, I used it on the second snap and I didn't have this issue. Now that particular issue I happen to know for a fact happens because of um, the way in which she stitches her pads. She doesn't top stitch around this bit um, here which is why the fabric can move here. However, I have just noticed that Jack has started doing um, stitching around all of her pads, Jackie sorry. Um, has started stitching all the way around her pads now so that shouldn't be an issue because that is what causes it so that is something you wouldn't have to worry about now but that was the major issue I had with it other than that the width I love because it's really really narrow and it really does work great for me it, this particular style is as you can see slightly flared here which is why it's called a curves range slightly flared towards the back but it's shorter at the back than it is at the front the front has a bit more length and the back is a bit more cur um, flared now I never bleed towards the front, I am not a front bleeder at all, I only ever bleed in the middle or towards the back, so I was very worried about the fact that this is shorter, but actually it's width does compromise a bit for the length, and I had no issues with leaking or anything, and this is a 10 inch pad, which is perfectly fine for my regular day. This is its thickness, it's still not one of the thinnest pads, but it's a lot thinner than my other pad, which is another issue I had with it, so she really has taken into account people's um, reviews, and my review and other people's reviews, and try to make her pads better and I really think she's done a great job so as I said this, the issue I had here has now been sorted and I'm pretty sure if you ask Jackie she will be happy to help you out with any queries you have but thanks for watching guys please subscribe and like Jackie on Facebook and look at her website which is dinky.spots or ddb and uh, I'll see you later bye bye